No, 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 okay. Everyone can party in my lobby. Just, uh, find me on Steam. Oh, yeah, bro. I do join game. They just are really safe. The thing about custom moves, making the game more technical, which I think it actually does do. I don't know if there's any broken custom moves, but custom moves are, um, um, I'm going to play Vega. The arguments for custom moves sound identical to the arguments for gems in Street Fighter Cross Tekken, and gems sadly would have improved a lot of the problems people had with the game, such as the low damage and the lack of mix-ups and whatnot. But gems were too much, people didn't want to fuck around with them. Wow. Then you could have dashed in. Ah, I got thrown! Damn, my claw. Or lack thereof. I had a kill combo there, for sure. Damn, that's too far. Ooh. <gasps> ah, could have cancelled it. Should have cancelled it. I held up. Fortunately, the combo is dropped. Ah. Uh... I feel like my favorite Smash to watch is Melee Doubles. I feel like it's a highly skill-based technical game. I feel like a lot of skill shines too. I feel like it's very entertaining to watch how partners support each other, how two characters can effectively work together. Stairman is not hitting Abel. I thought that was a pretty good no oh shit, pretty good normal in this matchup. Hmm, that's nice. That's good. That's a good reversal. Mm. Whoa. Uh. I'm so dumb. How did I just throw the game away? I tried to walk under. That might kill. I'm maskless Vega. No, now I'm maskless Vega. It's still gonna kill, I think. How did I just throw the game away? There's no meter. The only way to land a crouch fierce was to just jump in and do crouch fierce. Why is it lagging? Maybe someone was joining right then. Does anyone have their mics on? A lot of people play without mic. Come on. We can all be chatty or we cannot.
Not Chatty isn't nice. Not Chatty's awful. Was that a low profile on Crutch Fierce? That was funny. Interesting. I don't know if I would have spent that meter at that stage in the round. Your meter is going to be precious for next round. My international lobbies are always the worst. Come on, it's 5 p.m. Okay, Cook Cricky, I'm gonna need you to. Oh shit! The tornado throw was early. Okay, that's good. That's a punish. That's gonna kill, for sure. Analysis, prediction, and reaction. Ah, uh, Close Fierce was actually pretty rad. Damn, I think I hear mic noises. Damn, don't let don't let Abel do this. Do an autocrack DX headbutt or something. You can EX headbutt that too. It's really risky to try and punish Abel when he's doing that actually. Just gotta react the right way and hopefully don't get tornado. Able actually has a decent mix up there. But uppercut is really unsafe, so you can't just easily go for that. All you have to do is block it right. But of course blocking is scary because tornado throw. Whoa. I wonder if he wanted that or if he wanted step kick. He might have been trying to whiff stay medium kick and get the throw, but it, it might have just been step kick with a failed input. I feel like this matchup is pretty good for Haunt. Is that a punish? That seems like a punish. That might not punish the light headbutt, but definitely the heavy one. It probably punishes all of them. Probably Ultra 2 punishes them as well. Abel's got okay punish options in his Ultras, but the rest of his punish options are all really bad. It's kind of better now that he's got Crouch 7 to EX uh, change direction. That didn't used to work. Uh, if that was EX headbutt, it would have been nearly over. Kind of hit EX headbutt just so much. I feel like Honda should just chill and sit on charge. He's probably empty cancelled to super. That's really unsafe. You shouldn't just let 8 bull crouch fierce. I'm sure you can do uh, low jab into EX headbutt to punish it or something similar. I'm pretty sure that, I'm definitely sure in Smash 1, 2, and 3 that you can't kill yourself with up B off the top of the ceiling no matter how high you get. I've never tried it in Smash 4. You have to take damage while being off screen for the top. Let me play some more Vega, redeem myself. I feel like this is a matchup that's good for Vega. I feel like Vega's punishing power is quite useful. hope it isn't giantly laggy. Giantly is now an adjective. Or I mean an adverb, since it's describing an adjective and using a Y. <gasps> Whoa, I could have died. He had the read. See how bad that punish was? I'm just hitting buttons. Ah, that hit my normal. It's really unsafe, too. I just let that happen. What? Where'd my throw? Ugh, I'm done. What the hell was that? Probably intended butt slam. Whoa. 
It's not even laggy considering it's Germany. Considering he's a Deutscher. He's a germ. Damn, the walk-in walk throw all confident. It's pretty nice. That was also pretty nice. Whoa, I don't think that was a punish. Definitely had a much better thing I could have gone for there. Oh, that was dumb. Why'd you do it? That was also dumb. I don't know how to play guys literally doing things. I don't know what that means. Az is here. He snuck in. I did. Secretly. Covert. Covert. Volcane. Yes. Do? Hello? Hi. Hello. It's a, it's a party now. It is. It's always a party with me. I have to order food now. So no. Somebody's mic is picking up their steam. I didn't even get messaged. Right. Oh man, I'm bringing out the big gun. <coughs> I play who I want to play. So I like almost had a panic attack the other night watching um, Graving get his ass whooped by Shine. I'm like, I need to have a secondary that's not Vega. And so, uh, like, I've been looking around the cast, and the only thing I think that covers the matchup that Vega has that I don't really like is pretty much Yun. Yun is the character that you will invariably find yourself playing if you start thinking about shit, how to cover yourself from all bad matchups. I think that's true. Not, not if you play matches or grappling. Maybe. Is it Maybe. laggy for you guys? It's not or terribly laggy. Me. If you're already playing Yang, you probably don't need a secondary gun. And similarly, if you're already playing Rufus or something. Oh, I was too early. Or maybe he'd already jumped. Probably I was too early. No. Yeah, because they were frames. If you saw him on the ground, then he no. Didn't if, you, if you if you already if you jump before the super freeze, pre jump frames you're only shown standing. In fact, you actually crouch for pre jump frames, or rather for the first free jump frame. Mm -hmm. I mean, I don't know. Maybe the second. I don't know. I don't know them from each other. Some of them look like they're about to jump, and some of them look like they're crouching, and some of them look like they're standing. Each character only has three free jump frames, right? Four. Four. I think. It, it's either three or four. You're either airborne fourth frame or airborne fifth frame. I don't know how it's counted. I need to learn the forte attack against Berlento. All applicable to Vega. It's weird. It's all about like knowing when to do wall jumps and air throws and stuff. Let's see forte or Vega. What? Uh, against Rolando. Oh. As either of these characters. Well, I dropped my combo and it was good for me. Oh, I kept the meter. Bonk, it I'm hits. Get combos. That's a free... Dude, I hit like a bunch of one-frame links last match. What do you want? Sometimes I hit them, sometimes I drop. Damn. I mean, I just want to see you performing well. I'm working on it. That's why I fucking met up to fucking practice Chun-Li today. It's because I took your advice to heart. Oh, fuck. Yep. That was greedy of me. Aw, oh, shit. I was so hungry. That was... 
That's not gonna get all the damage, is it? I don't know if it gets all the damage in a jungle state. Yeah, I'm not dead yet. No, you have to land, like, you can't come down on the top of it. You need to be... I just want to jump strong. At the, I'm at dead. The bottom of it. This is bad. This is dire. I'm really surprised that That's a punish. didn't SPD you. I thought he was gonna. Yeah. I thought it was all ogre. Dalsim has three pre-jump frames. Grapplers have varying amounts. Ah, that was nice. I think Hugo has like seven. Poor Hugo. And I think Zangief has six. Zangief is a character I've been considering. Because he's a lot like Vega. Is he? News, yeah. news to me. You were I mean, the whole the whole idea is like you're gonna whiff punish something, you're gonna get in, you're gonna... Well, I guess he's not that much like Vega. He's like Vega in the fact that he likes to stay on the ground and play pussy. That's possibly and true. He he... And he'd prefer his opponent to do it too. Zangief has no particular that. attachment to the ground. Zangief uses the ground or aura as it suits him. Sure, but he, he's not... He doesn't have, Like, people don't really jump in on Zangief a lot. That's true, because he has a good anti-air. People jump out against Zangief all uh, the time, and they usually jump against Zangief that's too. Fine. That's fine. You know, if more if people were doing that stuff as opposed to jumping in on me as Vega, I would be a happy camper. Mm. I mean, I think that the thing that attracted me to DJ in the first place was consistent anti-air. So that's certainly something he has. Yeah, DJ. Yeah. Yeah, um, that's the one thing he has. Kicks. Yep. Light up kick. And medium punch is pretty good, even if it crosses over because the close one will hit a button. Yeah, he. They get a little bit more difficult. I think we're going to backdash more. Yeah, you should. Backdashing is really good on some characters. Mm -hmm. I mean, good. Uh, I was watching the um, Winter Brawl footage recently, and. Like, um, what does it say? Anyone Strider does an option select with his jab and forward dash to, to follow up back dashes. Which is apparently nuts on Able. Makes a lot of sense. Because if you, if you get the jab, then you get, um, EX, um, change direction. And if you get the forward dash, then you're, like, pretty neutral or in, at slight advantage. Um, and right next to them. So you can go in here, kind of. Um, ah! Forward. MK. Mix up game. Bag dash in the corner, very real. Oh shit. What'd I do it? Uh. I got I gotta look up the vulnerability on. Um. Different Marseilles, Marseilles The invincibility is long as fuck on all of them. It's just uh, they don't have startup invincibility except the uh, the X one. Yeah. But the invinci he's basically invincible to everything except throws for all the time he's actually rolling. Wow. Look at that crazy option select. <laughs> I deserve that. That might go under. Nope, didn't. He did. It, he knew exactly what I was gonna do, and he did exactly the thing to punish it. Still a 50-50 though. I could have just thrown him. Oh. Yeah, jumping it. He knew he still had a hard time of it. It wasn't. It wasn't over even with that ultra. I'm texting on a. I'm, I'm skyping on a smartphone while I'm playing uh, fighting games. This is awesome. Did you just get a smartphone? Yeah, literally yesterday. Oh. Cool. Nice. Which one? It's a Samsung Galaxy S2. It's a hand-me-down. Oh. I my mom had one of those. It's it's not quite as good as my. I'll be right back. Uh, my LG G3. Claw. 
The phone is nuts. I'm in love with it as a piece of technology. At first I didn't know what, how to feel about a smartphone, but now I'm warming up to it a lot. Now I'm starting to realize it's kind of cool. Kind of cool. Yeah, but I have a laptop. Oh fuck. Fuck. You see that? Ah! Do you use the MK? I don't know, actually, because your hitbox during that is weird. During focus? Yeah, she's letting me in. Yeah. Well, no, just, oh. I thought you wouldn't expect really it. Okay. I kind of expected it. I, I should have won that round. Yeah. I was busy trying to explain how Crouch MK would probably miss the lower part half of her hitbox during focus. All part of my plan. It's so not probably about it, it does, I can confirm. Oh. Uh. I don't know why it bothers. Yeah, you can't, you can't live profile, or oh. you, you have to fuzz here. Oh my god. Damn, I could have died there. Not correct. Not what I meant to do. I'll say. Uh, I, I tossed both of those down. Did you try to go from down back to down forward uh, hop kick? Yeah. I do that all the time. Yeah. It's one of the perils. You want your charge, and then you wanna you wanna do a hop kick. Yeah. I mean, I've been trying to ignore like charge on Vega lately. Because it doesn't give you that many more options. So yeah, it's honestly, really Vegas the biggest the biggest example of a charge character who can play footsies. Mm -hmm. Yeah, well, he's just not at all reliant on any of his special. Like, it's nice to have back charge sometimes. Yeah. For ex roll. Uh, it's nice to have down back charge sometimes for other things, but a lot of his punishing power comes from uh, ex flying breaks though. Yeah, but getting down charge is really easy. That's true. You can get it from a lot of his things. Yeah, well, almost all of his confirms go into his punches, which are always good when you're sitting on the ground. So. Damn. Should, should you have gone for the... Um, What's the other ender? The one, the one where she like twirls in place. Oh, Link's tail does less damage. I would have had to use meter. But you, but you could have put a bar. You could have put a bar. I could have killed him. I could have killed him with bar, but I didn't want to burn bar. It's the end of it. I mean, well, <gasps> my low strong just whiffed. That's good practice. There's a point where there's not a whole lot of expectation that you can still lose a round. Yeah. And you just want to save your meter. That was bad. Uh, I'm from the school, but you, you, you take the round if you can get it. Well, yeah, but I mean, if you can take, if you're gonna take the round either way, there's no need to burn your super to kill someone when you're up 90%. And they have. Uh... Oh, I fucked that up. That would have killed. Oh, he's dumb though. Sorry, deals. You're not dumb. Oh. You did fuck up a pretty clutch opportunity, though. Oh yeah, because he could have just altered two you. Yeah. All I had to do was it's three uppercuts. I should have died there. He wasn't even terribly laggy. I know. Playing with kills is never that bad. Because I get the punish on light headbutt with right, um, stand MK, and that's first um, game of the day. Prepare yourself. Where did Dirk go? He fucking he fucked off. He's doing dishes. Oh, a little bitch. How can this even be a lobby with that dirt? I don't know. Here I come. Fuck. Shit. 
I've got a pipe. Pipe. Uh, I'm dropping links all over. I could have been ultra one. Pipe. You're not playing Ken, dude. Yeah. Thank you. Oh, God. Alright. This might go better. That's a good attitude. Ooh, nice. That beats everything. I mean, everything you have at that jump arc, sure. Keep overhead for killing me. The stun is killing me, too. God. I did like the building, the EX uh, meter. With the light one? The light, that was yeah. cool, wasn't it? Did you, did you know that um, it would do that going into the light, or did you react? Um, yeah, I knew. Okay. Light into EX does more damage than just EX by itself anyway, so it's not like it would have changed what I did. I mean, you didn't have the bar. Yeah, I know. I saw that I didn't have the bar. Yeah. And I realized, you know, by the, I was like, the light will build it. But... Um, I, even if even if I wasn't gonna build the bar, I would have just done light into heavy. Yeah. So didn't matter. Well, that combo is cool as hell. And I guess you just do the the three button thing and just you'll get it whichever one you want or whichever one the game's gonna give you. I kind of has a hard time punishing that. That was not a combo. <laughs> What's the Elena Adon matchup like? I don't know. I haven't played Elena versus most characters. Ah, uh, I dropped it. Ah, uh, I dropped it. Ah, uh, I dropped it. If this Makoto would ever, like, hold back for a while, she might even be able to punish you. Yeah, Quirky, that's actually good advice. That being said, don't eat overheads. Because here they come. Oh, nice back dash. That was the big thing I was doing against you that I noticed is kind of missing from my game. Is that you need to back dash a lot against Lena. Yeah. Well, it's Chun Li. It's not good advice yeah. for everyone. Well, I mean, but Vega has a big back dash too. It's yeah, it's good. It's worth definitely worth using. Anytime you can dodge a mix up, that's good. Should go without saying. Mm -hmm. I gotta work on my. Uh, my option select sweep with uh, non-chaining normals is kind of bad and sloppy. I need to work on that. Hmm. That's like something that he definitely showed me that I'm going to get killed if I don't know how to do that. Hmm. Also in the chat, no dime, I'm not hungry. Also, I'm running a lobby. You know, he's gotta run that he's trying in the lobby until at least like twenty wins, right? Hell yeah, no, I might stop after this one. Hmm. I kinda feel like watching. Fast the voyeur. Yeah. Exactly. These are jumping they have virtually no jumping out of them is actually quite viable because they have no vertical box. Almost at all. I mean it depends on the timing. I don't know why I didn't just cancel immediately. I definitely should have. You wanted to build suspense? I don't know. It's I built meter doing that, I guess. But I definitely didn't do that with that in mind. Yeah, 
that's the one thing. Dashing on a controller is so much easier than dashing on a stick. Because returning to neutral is actually like a pretty big motion. Alright, I'm gonna sit and watch. Oh, so I, you're making me play Honda? Yeah. Honda's good for Vega, I think. I think, I think so too. I just you can punish any headbutt with stand medium kick. And that's I pretty know. nice. It is. And you can, okay. um, you can instant overhead him. You can, you can do a lot of things that annoy Honda. Yeah, and also your air normals. Yeah, your air normals beat hit a lot of his air options, and your ground normals completely shut him down. And your overhead is very spammable mm -hmm. and annoying. It's really hard for Honda. Yeah, the only time it gets difficult is when... And did you know you can actually... Anything that's not a light or an EX um, headbutt can be punished with Ultra. Yeah. Yeah. I thought EX good now. They changed I, I They changed DX. It recovers closer now. Minus eight. Oh. So it would have to be right in the startup hitbox. So you'd have to get reverse Ultra. And have it hit on the first frame. There are other things about this matchup that make it kind of annoying for Honda players. It's kind of bad for Vega when Honda starts really getting off hands pressure, though. Yeah, it's because uh, he, he has a lot of frame traps that Vega has a hard time dealing with. Oh. Uh oh, it's all ogre. I think ever since Ultra, Honda's EX command grab is a true reversal. It actually beats Vega's safe jump. Oh. That's nice. Oh my god, he, I don't, he, he's still alive. <laughs> I'm so scared. Oh, did somebody beat the uh, bat? Oh. No, I, went, I stepped down. Oh, okay. He was, he was too scared of me. Mm -hmm. Yeah, that's probably it. Bat always ducking me. He just doesn't want to get exposed. I probably played more, you almost as much as I played anyone. And by that I mean like you probably... Oh, that's nice. I think. Oh. Oh. Oh, you big op. Yeah. Notably... Whoa, don't just let him do that. You got oh, full screen wow. presence. Um. Oh, you had it. Neat punish. Oh, I'm awful at this game. Holy crap. Yeah, that was the wrong combo. Entirely. Should on low forward, low strong. Why? Low forward, low strong is so much better than what you're doing right now. You're just doing it after jump ins. Jump ins, you can do anything. Low forward does no. more damage, more hits done. I am so bad at this game, dude. It's okay. Fucking all you just gotta do. Why do you do one frame link? You don't need to. <sighs> Why is that your punish? Because. Oh, what the? Ooh! I'm so upset with myself right now. Remember that uh, EX off the wall is actually a lot easier and does almost the same damage as EX flip. But you should go for hard flip because EX yeah, is not I, worth I, the meter. I do the hard flip all the time, like without thinking it. Normally, that's the thing. Oh crap! It's full game. What do you mean crap? I hate. I don't like playing as Makoto. <laughs> no wait, wait, no, that's the other guy. Cookie's oh, Makoto. Cookie. Yeah, I don't mind playing it for you. I actually figured out the Ryu matchup a little bit better the other day. I feel like at the highest, highest level, Ryu is actually good against Vega. I think it's like a 5.5, 4.5. That would make sense, but I, I just figured out good spacing for focus attack in terms of punishing fireballs and stuff. Yeah, it's it's normally... Normally Vega has good tools against Shodos. Yeah. But fireball... Ryu's fireball game is actually really good. When played absolutely correctly. When played complete, when com win. completely formulaic. Why am I... Still going for that? Yeah. Just, just, just have a plan of I should jump in and then do low forward, and then low strong, and then do the jump in after you have that plan. Interesting. I can't believe I messed that up again. Mm -hmm. You can just da um, down, down fierce one. Down, down fierce is probably yeah one of your better options there. Sure, you can is actually better, but it, it tends to go the wrong direction. Damn it! Yeah, that car throw. With yeah. my gut and I, I, I love the, um, the whole back car throw. It's so dirty. Yeah. They, they see you walking away from them, and then you get thrown. Elena has a back car throw, too. 
It's not as good though. Oh. oh. Should have thrown there. Block level one focus is very minus. Had to go for a uh, hold backward delayed throw. Ooh, first hit only. That sucks. Oh, ah, it's facing. I think you can actually still combo if it's first hit only. I think the first hit does a lot more hits than the second hit. So even though it should miss, oh, ooh, not a good fireball. You gotta throw fireballs yeah, in this matchup. I, yeah, I mean you kind of do. You throw them when you're at full screen. No, you throw them even closer. You throw them all the time. The only time you, don't, you like if Vega's jumping in, then you've already you're already throwing enough fireballs. Oh. Wow, not an ultra. That's important. That's a big drop. That would've been really nice. Oh, sure. One of the things you don't realize as a replayer until you're a pretty high level is just how many ti how many different ways you can land Ultra One. Like obviously, like it conventionally has a lot more setups than it was. Nice. Oh, no, no, too far, too far. Oh. No, it is. Damn. Wow. I doubted it for a second. I forgot that I could get Ultra off of Fireball. I was waiting, but you yeah, yeah, both uh, both Vegas Ultras go through Fireballs pretty reliably. Mm -hmm. The other one is slightly better. Yeah. In the I've, been, I've been switching to Ultra Combo W for um, some matchups, including versus Rose, just to get myself a bigger window to punish your fireballs. It's all right. I tend to like Ultra Two Pure. I mean, I think it's I think it's fine in either either way. Like, the whole point of Ultra Two is to have a decent-ish reversal and an okay anti-air. It keeps people off you. Yeah. Um. And like. You don't need all the damage. You're, you're fine without it. The threat of it, it tends to be enough. I feel like the best possible reversal they could give Vega is like Hunt is 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 Hakan's Ultra Two, but it wouldn't make any sense if they gave it to him. I feel yeah, like that's just just yeah. what he needs. Like from a from a gameplay perspective, it's what he needs. But from like a from a visual perspective, it's like how could you possibly make an Ultra where Vega like <laughs> does anything like that? Cross-ups, like if he only had to deal with meaty pressure that was just on the ground, he would be fine. Or he would be still bad, but he would be okay. It would be manageable. But the problem is you oh. you, you lose... Wow, interesting juggle. Wow, dropped every part of that. Hurry up. There, there should be normal jumps. Not serial geese, I should just be jump normals. It's difficult though, it's hard to approach Vega. It's hard to know what exactly. You should be using focus dash in a lot. It's nice. But now that I've said that, maybe you shouldn't. That was perfect, but you dashed twice, but you still managed to pick it up. Oh. That was good. Good conversion. Should have made Meaty stand strong, I think. Vega crumbles to pressure once you actually start some getting some off. You're jumping an awful lot. Counter Ultra 2 would be okay. Oh. A Counter Ultra 2 would be great for Vega. That would actually be amazing. But the problem is they need to not they need to fix counter ultras. Right now they're not viable at all. I just want the clock. Oh god. I knew it was coming. Oh shit, I should have picked up my mask there. Yeah right. Actually no, you should have picked up your mask. The damage increase didn't matter at all there. Then the defense increase would have been okay. Yeah. I, I've been kind of making that distinction lately. Where I just don't want to die off of like some like random counter hit or something. And like off something that can barely be confirmed. So I, I pick the mask back up. Picking the mask up is kind of annoying on pad because uh, you have to hit two buttons because if you hit three buttons you get a backflip. But the backflip takes up no, it only picks up the clock. Uh, yeah. It doesn't pick up the mask. Oh, I really hate this matchup. How counter ultras could be fixed in two seconds, literally just by not having an ultra freeze. This is like a hard matchup for Vega. If it just if it just sucked up your ultra and it activated, but it didn't freeze the screen. And that way like the thing about counter ultras <laughs> is that they proclaim that they're happening on the first frame of their activation. So the only way that people can actually hit you is on the first, like if they don't, um, if they just do it on the on the first possible frame. The only way that people can hit you is if they're already committed to something, and if it's not an armor breaker. 
And the problem is all the things that you can react to easily are armor breakers, because if they weren't, they would be shitty, because you could just focus them. For example, um, Blanca Balls, maybe. Or like Rainbow Roll. Well, not Rainbow Roll, because that is not armor break. Like, any move... Any move where you have a shit ton of time to react is usually armor break, because it would just not function if it didn't armor break. Oh, the EX, EX change of direction. Virtually all of Vega's, I mean all of uh, Abel's uh, reversal options are throwable. The only one that's not is reversal tornado throw. Ah, fuck. Yeah, yeah, it's very difficult to get out of. He could have actually just cancelled that to EX change of direction. I think it might have been I, I know. even worse for you. Or regular change of direction, actually. Oh, oh my god. How I, how, oh my god. It's, Vega doesn't have a great punish, though. Oh, yeah. so you gotta go for a hop kick. You gotta lose your charge to block that. And you can't be point blank for a uh, stand fierce into fierce roll. That actually worked. That What'd you do? What? He, he was pressing heavy punch or something? He didn't. I didn't see a startup of an animation. Heavy punch has four frame startup, dude. I would have oh seen my it. God. No, because it looks just like his. <laughs> his neutral? New it looked yeah. like his neutral. Oh my god. Mm, that was so good. Bad, that was good. He got yeah, it on you. Like, I, I literally should have been pressing stand heavy, heavy kick that entire match, and I just wasn't. Um, so, when you get focused with Vega, with low strong, uh, a gimmick you can pull, it's not 100% reliable because they can dash forward, but you can cancel the low strong into backflip, into the short backflip, and then it makes their uh, focus whiff. And then when their focus whiffs, you recover in time that you can get low strong at the X off the wall. But they yeah, can't they can forward dash. That is a good gimmick. Yeah. I like that. You can cancel into those flips like special moves. They function like special moves. Huh, I should do that more. Yeah. <clears throat> they unfortunately have a shit ton of uh, active periods, so it's not actually good most of the time. Oops. But against focus, it's and good. It's good, good against focus, and it's good against throw. Dude, Afro, you just let me skip. It's fine. I got red bars against everyone anyway. Really, that matchup is particularly... Annoying for me, just because I don't back dash well, and um, you need to do it a lot. To yeah. Match up. And you get so much out of it too. You, uh, yeah, back dash is real good against uh, Abel. He doesn't have a great chase. His best chase is step kick, but you have to be kind of predictive. You can't options like step kick. Mm -hmm. I don't think against most back dashes. Mm -hmm. yeah. but, but he can yeah, do walk in step kick and punish. Dying to not um, canceling. Um, Against focus stacks. That's all I did last round. Eat focus stacks, yeah. They're normally really good against. Stan Reinhardt isn't even that good against uh, Abel's focus because actually he gets really small for his focus. So the second hit, or the first hit can whiff. Or the second hit? I don't remember. One of the hits whiffs. So, uh, you actually have a kind of a hard time. The best answer against. Ooh, nice. Best answer you have against focuses, Abel focusing, is uh, low strong into EX off the wall. Because that'll catch the yeah. forward dash, back dash, and release. But you need charge for that, so it's not always there. I mean, I, I had it. Yeah, you had it. I just wasn't doing the cancel. Volcane, looking solid. Whoa. Whoa. Yeah, that's a punish. Uh, that... I don't, I don't know about that ultra. I probably would have sat on yeah. it. Especially considering the fact that uh, how much meter builds for the other guy. It's like a quarter of a bar. That was good, though. <laughs> it's hard. He jumped over you. Probably screwed your inputs. Ooh. This might be... Uh, get able, Ab able gimmicks. You definitely saw it in the sense that he's already been doing that while you've been in the lobby. Yeah, fuck. So, uh, after after roll, after after crouch fierce, he can juggle into stand fierce and then cancel into uh, a, a roll. And he'll either go past you or not go past you. That only works in the corner. I mean, but then the nice thing is, is that, like, you can... You can autocorrect stuff, or you can um, you can react. It's not the hardest thing to react. Should have released there. Would have been good. Hey, discipline, like he disciple of Yogma. Unless he does like Yogma. DX, um, his command throw, like throw beats all of his options. It's a regular command throw that throw that throw beats. I mean, that beats throws. Okay. Yeah, his EX command grab is invincible. His oh, that's nice. It might be a little early. Abel's big though, so he yep. might juggle. Oh no. Yep. Um. 
What was I going to say? Uh, yeah, it, EX, EX Tornado Throw is hit invincible. Regular Tornado Throw is the throw invincible one. That's got to be an awkward motion, too. Whoa, that was the big opportunity. No. That's what you needed. That jump in roundhouse at the end. That's a shame. You did okay. Damn. You know, what I've noticed about getting better at this game is that I I see how how much better people are than they see in themselves type stuff. Where I, I see like their strengths and their weaknesses, but like some people are really good at small parts of the game and they don't even give themselves credit for it. A lot of people. I feel like there's so many. There's a million different ways to be good at this game, and I feel like the better someone is, the more areas where they're good. And I feel like a lot of people get really good at some particular things. And that can be like that can be obvious things like particular matchups. Like if you're mm. if you're like a new player and you your your friend is like a fucking like a Sagat, and you play Ryu, you're gonna get really good at fighting Sagat really fast. But you're not gonna have a lot of other matchups. So you're gonna be like floundering. You're gonna be you're not gonna look like a great player against most people. Then you fight a Sagat and you're like oh like oh my god this guy's really good at fighting Sagats. But that's like the obvious way. But there's a lot of unobvious ways that people are good at that too. Like some people yeah. like like find punishes in training mode and then whenever or like memorize frame data. And then whenever they're in a scenario where they have like an obscure punish, they can just hit it, and um, they don't know footies or stuff like that. And it's just like, um, um, it, it's it's like they're really good at that little punishing element, or like being ready for juggles or obscure scenarios. I don't know. There's a lot of scenarios in which people can be good at random things, be good at focus, using focus. Focus is very complex. Hey, what do you want, Colton? Calling her girlfriend. That's how I talk when I'm talking to my cat. I'm just like, what do you want, cat? Yeah. No, we call each other girlfriend and boyfriend. Um, actually, so I've been doing a personal project. I'm translating um, a Zen t text um, in the context of fighting games. Or games in general, rather. And I actually just wrote the section that kind of deals with that. Neat. Yeah. I'll send it to you when I'm done. But it basically, like... There's principle and there's technique, and a lot of people are good at like half of that. You'll see the, the training mode monsters who always know their combos, and then you'll have the people who always know the punish type situation. Deals. And why are you an Ultra 2 Honda anyway? In this matchup, Ultra 2 isn't terrible, but like, why are you an Ultra 2 Honda? I don't know, I like it. Oh. Can you hear me, by the way? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Oh, that's good. I like Ultra 2 in every matchup, but there's not fireballs being thrown in your face. It's not a one-frame ultra. I don't like it. It's like three. Okay. It's a two-frame ultra, I think. It's a, you can jump out of it, regardless. Mm -hmm. It might even be a one-frame ultra, but it's whatever it is. It's one frame after the ultra freeze. It's probably just one plus one. Well, I mean, two-frame punishes are still pretty good. Yeah, they are. Yeah. But it's point blank only. So it's only really good in some matchups, like Oni. Like, if he does Light Slash, you can punish it with Ultra. But, um... You'd get so much more mileage out of, like, anti-air Ultra 1s, anti-fireball Ultra 1s, like, I don't know. Block the last hit of that high too. Yeah, or low, depending <coughs> on which one he does. But you but you don't actually have to... Uh, once you block the second one, you can stick shit out. You can what? He's minus 4. You can stick shit out. Oh, yeah. Um, it, it, I don't know, like, because even, even if the frame data says minus four, like, he's canceling the recovery of the second hit to no, do the third um, hit. I, saw, I, saw. I know it's not a true block string, but I don't know if you can get normals out in time. There, there's something you can do. Just DP it. it might you can definitely DP it. That always beats um, that after the second hit. Focus? Regardless of... I think it's either focus or something else. Focus would work, yeah, because you can absorb low or high. Oh wait, what the low? I don't know. You uh, yeah. block it correctly. The first hit is the first hit is minus three, which you can ultra. So you can after blocking a racket, you can actually just mash ultra and it'll work. So actually, that's pretty good. Um, but if he does the second and third hit, it's an overhead and a low, and you have to react to which one to block correctly. But then it's unsafe. That was actually really good. But there are some things characters can do to just get out of the whole thing. Like I'm pretty cool. sure I'm pretty sure you can do a reversal I don't know actually for Honda. Honda's moves aren't very fast. But definitely Ultra 2 you can mash out. I got a going I think I saw it on on the subreddit. Let's check.
Abel's cool. You don't see a whole lot of Abel's. I don't know why. He's not a terrible character. He's kind of hard. He's not that hard. He's the character who's most dependent on one frame links of any character in this whole game, which is kind of sad. He has an unplinkable one frame link and there's absolutely nothing he can do about it and it's super crucial to his game. Oh, too far. This is a matchup where I feel like uh, Makoto actually shines. She's got a lot of fun things in this matchup. I want to see you block a step kick and do a reversal EX Karakusa. Oh, I, I guess what you do is you literally just mash on, um, you, you hold you hold back and you mash on throw because the startup of the low variation gives you enough time to throw him out of it. Oh, and the high um, one you just block? Yeah. That's smart. I like that. Whoa, the cancel into the tornado throw trying to catch a focus or something? What the hell? That's a really, it might have been an accident. That's good. <gasps> oh, you're right. Got to work on the cancels. I'm right about what? Um, the, he did he, the EX, um, uh, the photo throw beat out his EX. Um, that was tornado throw? I thought that was roll. I wasn't looking. Um, I mean, I saw a standing startup animation. Might have been EX tornado throw. The EX tornado throw is definitely throwable. Hmm. I've thrown it many times. That's like the mix up. So my girlfriend wanted me to order food, but she never told me what she wanted, and then she went back Pizza. to sleep. Dude, you're gonna go and ask her what she wants, and she's gonna say, "I don't know." And then, no matter what you get, we, she's gonna. We're getting, we're getting, we're getting Thai food. Oh, okay. So probably just get her pet to you, dude. That's like the best Thai food. Pad Thai. Like, it's the best. Pad Thai is good. Pad Thai. Because I don't think she'll be. No matter what, she can't be too unhappy about it. Oh, oh that does so much damage when it counter hits. Look at that. Able's uh, fucking Vegas taking one hit. Abel gets shut down in footsies in this oh, matchup. But if he actually starts getting this off, it's really difficult. Abel's very much a momentum character. Oh, that's, I don't think Abel had a punish besides Ultra, which he should have gone for. But it's okay, it's a hard reaction. Nice autocorrect. Should have whiffed another one for me to build. Mm, oh my God. I didn't know that. I didn't know that. You get counter hit for each individual one. Most moves aren't like that. That's really interesting, actually. It's really interesting that the first the first hit came out, and then you can he could still get counter hit for nearly every two hit move, or three hit move, or multi hit move. After the f only the startup of the first hit can get counter hit. Oh shit! Uh, if that was ultra. You would have won. I know. No, I would have gotten chipped if I had altered. What do you mean you would have got chipped? Well, you would have no, killed no, him. If I reaction ultra. No, I, I was I had a different plan in mind. Oh. The jump in strong after back throw doesn't work on Abel because he can EX tornado throw to anti safe jump. I learned that the hard way. Jeez. Abel has one of the characters with an anti safe. That was a punish. He got an accidental input. Mmm, that interacted favorably for Abel. Remember, if you want to be a hero, knock Abel over and then throw him on wake up. Backflip there would have been okay. Back dash would have been even better. He's using focus as a reset. That's like what I do. Holy crap. Uh, you got the punish too, but it was a bad one. And I, I should have been mashing throw. Just, I am You're done. Hearted. I like didn't do the stuff that I said. Like, yeah, I know. It's, I mean, it's That's the difference between knowledge and, you know. It's, I haven't practiced But even if I hadn't practiced it, it's like the easiest thing to do. I was just thinking about other things. Like, again, I think I can... That's, that's still the difference between knowledge and down execution. Down. Well, yeah, but for me, it's like... You know, I have to be. I have to increase my presence of mind in order to. I'm gonna knock this down. This has gone on too long. <laughs> but it's no fun if I just turn off the sound. I don't get to talk to you guys. More than a game is my favorite title, or my favorite little message at the bottom. I've liked it a few different ones at different times. Ooh, that was a good jump. And I grabbed a clutch deck. Yeah, the overhead. I didn't even let it overhead me because I wasn't even down backing. 
That was dumb. I don't know why I went for that. Fearless. That was not what I wanted. He blocked the whole thing. That's minus two if you blocked the whole thing. And therefore safe. Shit, my jab. Ugh, I blow blocked. Last hit. I know. Where's my combo? I actually fucked the shit. I fucked the I fucked the block at the end. It was like not even a hard block. It was just a cross up. Yep. But I, I just I slipped. Fighting April is that it forces you to be That's really nice. disciplined. If you, if you know the matchup, it's not that hard. But I probably took as much chip as I did damage. <laughs> Damn. That kind of whiff throw is the reason that people crouch tech, one of them. Damn. Damn! That kind of hit. I, I, just don't, I don't think I like Ono's design. <gasps> I got so lucky. He committed to a backdash. Mm. <gasps> I deserve that. <gasps> Book! Book! What just happened? I don't know. It was weird. I don't think I'm in there in time. You can actually, this works on. Oh, I missed it. He didn't quick stand. No, it didn't matter that much. Uh, I got smacked. You should have gone for a super. Is that an overhead? Uh, yeah. Close round is an overhead. It only turns into an overhead if you're low. Like, the second hit normally doesn't even come out at all. But if you're crouching, the first it whiffs. And, um. The second hit can. will be in range to connect. That's weird. Uh, that ultra was so terrible, too. I could have just gone for super into ultra. I could have gone for anything. Yeah, I know. The two, I thought you were going to go for the super into It was a really tight... Like, Abel, you have more time to juggle than other characters. I know, but you, you were still, like... It was it was uh, cutting it real close. I probably missed it by one frame, I swear. Staff means I work for Capcom. I definitely work for Capcom. Maybe you didn't know that about me. I am a Capcom employee. Completely yeah, serious. Beat this guy with DJ. Maybe. I should have just followed my heart and played a matchup he didn't know. Oh shit. Like Elena. I, I think Abel's somewhere on the hard, difficult to figure out in game matchup. This guy is on read. What should I put on my smartphone? Uh, depends. What do you want? I have Twitch, YouTube, and Skype. Lots of porn. Porn on a smartphone? Yeah. It, it's better than you think it is. I have Adblock Plus, barcode and QR scanners. I got... What'd I get? I got Gmail. I swear I got some other stuff. Twitter. I got Twitter. Oh. I can tweet right now from my smartphone. I'm gonna oh make man. a I'm gonna make a tweet. Welcome to 2012, dude. I'm. I I'm tweeting. Don't throw a fireball, dude. I know. <gasps> okay, that won't count, right? From. A oh. smart. I think if you'd use the heavy, the heavy version as opposed to the EX version, that might have chipped. Oh, uh, doesn't EX do more chip? Girlfriend. Yeah, hard does the most chip. You go back to sleep. You want? Fuck. Do you want chicken pad thai? Tweet. What do you want from Hi-Fi? Hell yeah! Someone go favorite that tweet. Okay. I don't use Twitter. I can't. Sorry. I need to make a new Twitter. Twitter like unless... the new Facebook. It, twi it like is it does a different thing. 2010. Like I know what it does, but I feel like everyone have a Twitter now. 
Oh, you mean like everyone's just suddenly jumping on it? Crookie. Yeah. As. It's you all of a sudden. <laughs> oh. That's because what's his face left the lobby? Whoa, direct messaging on Twitter? I didn't know that. Oh no, I did. The coolest thing my new phone does is that it tells me when someone comments on one of my videos on YouTube. Oh, fucking... Afro just bounced. Good games. It, yeah, I can I can look at the comment. It's kinda cool. I'm not gonna lie, my absolute favorite thing is to... is when someone comments on one of my videos. Cute. Cute combo. Oh, I grabbed the headbutt. I saw it. Saw the first frame of headbutt. <gasps> Woo! Good ninja jump. Terrible, uh, whiff, uh, stand fierce though. Jump fierce. Deals is better than his points would suggest. Unfortunately, you get nothing meaningful when you trade with, a uh, um, Scarlet Terror. I know. Dude, I'm really bad. No, you're alright. You get kicked in the face. <sighs> Don't do that. Don't do that. Not in this matchup. Oh, he switched to Ultra Double. He must have heard all that Ultra Ultra Two talk. Been yeah, like, must have been like, okay, I had no doubt you were, you heard it. But must have been. Oh, that would have been a gold Ultra Two actually. Yeah. Jump over as during the whiff fierce. Anti air Ultra One is pretty good. Fuck. Yeah, that was a really bad jump. Oh no. Oh, you could have low strong EX off the wall. Claw. What to do against Vega. Yeah, you gotta, uh, trying to get into hand. focus oh, and jab hands are both essential in this matchup. Okay. Jab hands is what you want to land all the time. You're basically trying okay. to get in range where you can land hands easily. That's like your whole goal. No, not like jab hands like that, I mean jab into hard hands. Can't believe you just anti air with that and it worked. Actually, that works quite well. Oh my god, I'm awful at this game. Watch your EX, but you, you can punish that as with uh, low strong. How do you punish Tiger Knee? Tiger Knee can be safe, depends on the spacing. If it's unsafe, and you'll get both hits. It'll get both hits really or quickly. EX is always safe. EX is always safe. EX is only minus one, I think. It's unsafe if you're a grappler. Um, yeah, that's, that's how Vega works. You gotta be focusing these normals. Okay. Wow. But now you can't because you have no health. Yeah, so it's tough when you're dead. It's tough when you're dead. It is tough when you're dead. It's very difficult to win when you've already lost. They should make it so you can't is die. You, you can't die to focus health. From my hands. I mean, I think that, that people complain that this game is already slow. It'd be faster if they remove charge characters. I don't know if that's true. <laughs> A lot of the really stally matchups are charge charge. The only character okay, I can think of who's fine. who's charge and not stally is Decapri. I mean, I think that, like, most of those matchups are, like, very specific old matchups. Yeah, they, they, uh, specifically, specifically the World Warriors have very stolly yeah. matchups. Charge World Warriors. Like, Honda Honda, Blanca, oh God. um, Guile. It's not that stolly. I mean, it can be if the Blanca gets life lead, but before that, as long as Blanca's behind, it's not very stolly. That's kind of true. Blanca's got to work hard for that money. Hello, list on Skype. Oh, oh man, dude. Baby's first smartphone. It really is. I missed the boat. Autocrack's trying to fucking make every word into different words. As I like how your Skype icon is like a Skype icon, but with a mustache and a beard. I, I set that to it the first day I got Skype and never changed it. Is that like one of the default ones? I think so. When did you get my Skype? I still I fucking I snuck it. The fail cup, right? Yeah, maybe. Oh no, I got it somewhere. You posted it in the in my Twitch to someone else, and I was just like, hmm, I'll have that. I'll have that Skype, please. I hope that doesn't count as snooping. It's fine, I don't really care. In case I ever need to be like, hey, as. 
Where's the, uh, where are the games? Where are the fight me? I'm pretty sure you can link straight into EX Scarlet Terror from EX Roll, which is pretty funny link. If it works. Which I can't guarantee it does. Gutex is available on my Skype. Should I say anything to him? What should I type to Gutex? No, don't bother Gutex. <laughs> oh, you should have let that rip. Fuck. I should ask Gutex for his phone number. I've always wondered what it was. It'd be cool if I could just dial up Gutex. Be like, hey. In the middle of Excellent Adventures recording, his phone just rings and it's just like, hey, it's Buffel. <laughs> hey, Gutex. Why am I still doing that? Holy crap. God, hanging out all today. That could have been ultra. I finally understand how people can be like unproductive now that I have a smartphone. Because I could be watching this match and giving advice on both sides. That was way too far. EX roll you have to activate from pretty close and predictably. Or else they can just uppercut you or worse. That being said, EX roll, like I've I've had I've done EX roll through a far view fireball. And then he racked at the EX roll and through Ultra One. The EX roll went through the Ultra One. It's like, huh? Yeah, I, I uh, <laughs> did against the Rose the other day. <laughs> she tried to activate Ultra Two and then just died. Yeah. It was great. I think I got the link too. I was like super hyped. That link is hard for me, and I don't plink it. I should. I plink that link, and I still miss it. That's like one of the only links I plink, and I still miss. I get it. I get it almost never. And yeah, I just got my first smartphone. I can get it like three times in a row on in training mode, and then as soon as I'm in the actual match, it's like the hardest thing in the world. Oh, well, because of like how long you have to wait. I just want to land like a red focus combo. And they're not hard. I just. Do you see the one I did a couple games ago? Yeah, with the off the heavy kick. Yeah, low forward heavy kick, red focus. That's a uh, that's max damage, no charge. That's important for that reason alone. I'm awful. There it is. And I had the extra time because of the... But I get benefited more from ultra changes than almost any character. Not his specific ultra changes, but the directional changes of ultra. Red it's focus benefits him a lot. Me. It's not gonna happen. Delayed wake up benefits him a lot. And ultra double benefits him decently. A split. Hey, Kuro. Kuro comes into my chat by saying I'm home. That's cute. Kuro is in fact the dank meme master. This phone falls asleep after like one second. Can change that. Yeah, I gotta fix that shit. It's like I fucking look up from my phone and then it's asleep. I need to make it like a minute. No, a minute's too long. 30 seconds. But definitely not fucking five seconds. That's just stupid. Why did everyone try and jump in that situation? That's I would, a bad space to jump in. Because they need big damage. I believe it was Air who said whenever you feel like jumping, dash in instead. But that being said, Makoto's dash in is still... Um, I don't want to say obvious. Well, yeah, I do want to say obvious. It's not bad just because it's obvious, though, it's, because... It's just, it's just what you're constantly expecting from Makoto. Anyway. Yeah, yeah. Pe Maybe focus dash People in. aren't normally expecting Ryu to suddenly dash in. People are expecting Makoto to suddenly dash in. Yeah. I think... Uh, yeah, I think that's correct. I think they, um, on Makoto, the adaptation is focus dash in. Because the way you typically stop, uh, um, beat a dash is to stop it. Like, for me, the biggest adaptation was... Whenever I felt like ultra chewing in an obvious situation, throw instead. Oh, why haven't I done a how to play Seth yet? I meant to do that one ages ago. I need someone who knows how to play Seth because my Seth is only okay. It's better than most yeah, like scrubs. Who's this? Oh yeah, does he have a Seth? Yeah, he used it. Yeah, he used it against me. I remember now. I played my lane against it. I remember. 
I'm still coming back. I remember I remember exactly how his death was. He was real happy with the forward dash. And it scared me because of how good it was and how good he was with it. I was terrified. Oh, that was supposed to be jump grab, not jump light kick. Hell yeah, smartphones are awesome. Wow. <laughs> I mean, he is in Germany. <laughs> that's, that's pretty unfair. Uh, early jump fierce. Jump strong is real good in this matchup. Whoa! Gotta work on those. Oh, that that was a good far fierce. That uh, crash jab could have punished that. Crash jab into head headbutt. That works, right? Or is it only crash jab into exit butt? Can you combo light normal into? Whoa, that's too deep. It's too deep. Yo, what? Oh, that should have been low forward hard headbutt. Deals, please. Okay, good to know, dude. I. Picked Let's up Honda like three days ago. Oh well, that n now you know that's your go-to punish. Okay. Oh, what the fuck? Oh yeah, it's difficult getting out of that. Oh, wow. Oh, that's an interesting focus. You could have released for a level one; it would have hit, I think. Oh. But you couldn't have gotten a punish, I don't think, because Honda's focus dash is too slow. They recovers too fast. Oh. <gasps> Oop, okay. Oh, okay. Ultra yeah, it could have been ultra two. Oh well, it's hard in the moment. No, 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 too far. Actually, it goes really far now, doesn't yeah. it? Oh, wow. Oh, wait, that was the other one. Dude, I fucking... I don't know them apart. I'm a scrub. I was so sure that was Ultra 2 in my head. Nope. <coughs> hmm. I put Dan there really bad. Damn. Someone told me on Twitter, they responded to my tweet, they said Hollywood. I am Hollywood Is now. Is that a good thing? Oh. Okay. Because of my smartphone. Oh. I've become Hollywood. Meaty stand strong? What does that do? It's like a worse version of meaty stand medium kick. If you're going to be doing meaty normal, stay medium kick and stay in heavy punch are much better. Or low forward. I was staying heavy punch. Oh. They look the same. Uh, medi medium punch comes in from the side, and media hard punch comes in at an angle. But I, I guess I just misinterpreted their early frames. But they do look slightly different, I think. Fuck, I tried to do ultra. <laughs> you should have just blocked it. And then uh, hit I had, they no, I had no life. Yeah, it, I don't, that does almost no chip. I think you'd have been fine. Really? Yeah. I think I'd it only does die. the one hit of chip. It doesn't do all the hits. Okay. Um. I've with it before. It, it, yeah, you can chip with it, but it's it's not very good. Um. And Honda has a lot of health. Don't forget, Honda's like eleven hundred. Yeah. Um. Where do you check chip? Do I have to? You have to do it in training mode. I think. I don't know. Yeah, maybe there's. Maybe it's on some frame data thing. Is it on FA two? I have no idea. I don't have it. Uh, I don't. Oh. oh, that's something you should You have a smartphone oh. now. You could get it. Oh, yeah. Wait, are you, do you have Android? Yeah, I could get it. Okay, yeah, it's on Android. Damn. Imagine that. I know. 21st century. I can just. I, I'm, I've, I've rejoined the human race. Technologically. <laughs> what? How do you, this thing has, like, everything else that does not have the chip. Vega actually has a surprisingly hard time chipping people out. Roll is very difficult to get in a true block string, and if people at the end of a match can be looking for the big punishes for anything they can react to, oftentimes that is roll. Um, yeah. Scarlet Terror is almost impossible to hit someone with. Um, Sky High Cloud is actually surprisingly little chip. And uh, what's, what's this other special move? Flying Barcelona is... Uh, very little. Yeah, there's an escape for, for most characters some way that they can hit you without having to block it. Ooh. You could have yeah, you could have released for a level 2. 
Well, who would have known in the moment? Nope. Oh, you could have. You're fucking up your focuses here. I know. <laughs> it's just it's incidental, though. It's, it's not anything you did wrong. It's good that you're focusing. It is. I feel like uh, focus should be in response to a problem, though. I mean, speaking of someone who focuses all the time for no good reason, uh, you should look at something that your opponent does that's vulnerable to focus and then do it. That move is fast, but otherwise shitty. It's very fast, though. Damn. Damn. Oh my god. Honda is apparently 1050 life, 1100 stun. He's not uh, 1100 health. If any character should be 1100 health, I feel like it should be him. I f I'd be ha I wouldn't I wouldn't feel like it would be broken if Honda had 1200. That'd be fine. Why are they holding out on Honda's health? He, mid -tier. he said he was like I don't know, dude. I feel like my cross would know better than anyone else. That's safe, I think. Yeah. Oh no, it's not. Never mind. Yeah, he that kicked really early. Yeah. It still looked deep enough that you, he could have landed. I was just wrong. I mean, he could have landed, but he, he had gotten rid of his trip guard. And that hits low. Yeah, but if you fall low enough, it, even your trip guard recovers in time. Or if you hit the, maybe it's the ultra sex. Yeah, yeah, but I, that's that's yeah. the thing, is I thought the height was low enough that his trip guard would come back. Oh. Elena has 2,000 two HP. Yeah, okay. Elena has a hard time recovering more than... Um, more than 150 health. The only guaranteed setup Elena has for um, a full recovery is super. And even then some characters can punish that. It's all what character you're fighting. Which is why healing is particularly good on some characters like versus others. Same idea. Mm -hmm. that. Uh, use Elena's focus like a poke? Yeah, why not? It's like it's like a it's like well, a that was fully projectile on you. Only once he hits the wall. Um, only once he hits the wall. Oh I've been misusing that this entire time. That's that shouldn't have been an ultra actually. Why? Uh you would have built you don't build meter when you land an ultra. You land you build uh, meter okay. when you land combos. If you can kill without an ultra, you always should. Roll a thumb. Yeah, Elena's her box is the big thing. That's not invincible, it's just four frames. It's just fast. Has a good hitbox. Sometimes. Sometimes it has a good hitbox. That's a good overhead. I think his overhead's really useful. It's like a better version of Fei Long's, but also not quite as fast. Mm. Should've been an ultra. That's uh, you gotta walk forward sweep there. I think for real, you can actually ultra it if you're if you've got good reactions. You can get reverse ultra. It's not even that hard. You have a safe jump with Ryu if you hold up forward after a sweep. It's a three frame safe jump, four frame safe jump. You can safe jump anything up to three frame moves. If they delayed standing, they can give you a little bit of a hard time, but it's still safe. And there are some characters who can beat safe jumps, and it's important to know who they are. I should do a primer about that. That'd be really cool. Characters who can beat safe jumps. Wouldn't that be useful? Damn, I did jump. Yeah, that that kick is really good. That'd be a really easy primer to make. My boy Plomp just yeah. messaged me. Yeah, I'm gonna let the other guys have a Wait, I sweep and then I hold up chat. forward, then do what? Punch uh, no, and just jump hard kick. Moves, just what? jump hard kick. Whatever, it doesn't matter. Jump hard kick? Okay. And it's a four frame safe jump. Okay. It's good. Did not know that. Yeah, now you do. Okay. I'll probably use it and then wait four frames and then. If it's. Three it, frame if can beat any it. three frame can beat it. And that's not three frame normals because they're not invincible. It needs to be something that's three frames and invincible. For example, reuse uppercut. Okay. Alright. Don't people know what safe jumps are? There have been a lot of tutorials on, on what a safe jump is. They're not all for Street Fighter 4, but it doesn't really matter because safe jumps are the same thing regardless of the game. Yeah. But I should do a tutorial on safe jumps. I've only mentioned safe jumps like in other tutorials. I've never actually explained what a safe jump is. So that'd be a really good primer. Yeah. Hmm. Uh, you gotta work on that, Crookie. 
that's bad. You can't you can't drop combos. Makoto has an anti safe jump with her EX Karakusa. It's the real laggy on my side, I hope it's good for you guys. It's fine for me. So it's probably just you. Sumo slam. I can't give any advice. Because I'm back in the past. Honda's hit confirms. Jab, jab, jab is real difficult for Honda. So you want to do a short, short jab, which you can blink. And short into jab is a two frame link. I think short into short is one frame, but it's blinkable. So it's a really good. If you're uh, like, it's really hard, but Hondas can do short, short jab hands roundhouse. Can you do crouch jab into hard hands reliably? That's like, that's like. Not really. That's a very important part of playing Honda. Yeah. Okay. Wh what the you do? do it right now, it hurts my hands. What? I just slide it. Oh well, that's fine. A lot of Honda slide it. What a lot of Hondas do is they do a uh, crouch jab for the crouch jab, and then they do strong, fierce, jab, fierce. Jab, strong, fierce, jab, fierce. And that'll give you a uh, crouch jab into hard hands reliably. And then from that you can link stand roundhouse. That's like Honda bread and butter combo. Because hands is safe and yeah. it does a lot of chip damage. And also it leads to a lot of damage when it works. Shit. Fuck. So bad. Kirky, how come you never ever ever go for any Karakusa combo except resets? I mean granted I only ever go for damage, but we should both we should both go for both of them. Sometimes reset, sometimes damage. That was a really good reset at the end, I just saw it. The jump fierce into <laughs> Karakusa. I hate this. When I type I, I have to do like three keystrokes to get I'm. Why is this so difficult? Uh, get swift key. Alright. That sounds like a good idea. Every time someone recommends me an app. But it came through with my phone, so. Yeah, swift key is free now too, so I think. Uh, I don't know. Should make no difference. Smartphones are awesome. Alright, my phone lasts for like a week. My old phone lasted for like a week. On one charge. And now this phone dies in like half a day. Yeah. That shit's annoying. Uh, sweep or uppercut would have been max damage. If you backdash, you'll have to get them at the end of their crumple. And if you're getting them at the end of their crumple, uppercut, hard uppercut does the most damage, and sweep gets the safe jump. For real. Ooh. EX Firewall. I just saw that. You're far behind, yeah. Yeah. Must because of the streaming. Where's my dash? Should Capcom versus SNK2 get an online remake? Yes. Why would it not? That'd be awesome. I think that's the only game. Every like, fighting game should get online made. Yeah. I think that's the fighting. Online did wonderful things to fighting games. It's like what online did to shooters. Um, 
But like that's the only good fighting game that, that hasn't gotten like an online remake by this point. Because a lot of them you can net play online remakes, but I don't think you can net play CBS2 on like MAME and emulators and stuff. I can imagine playing a shooter offline, like competitively. Like, that's that's what people used to do with fucking. Global offensive. That's what people used to do with like Goldeneye and shit. The fuck. What was that? What was that app called? Swift Key. Yeah. I'm on it. Oh, splits here. I didn't even realize. I split. Swift key keyboard plus emoji. Okay. I want all the emojis. Fuck. The thing about fighting games is they aren't super fun until you know what you're doing. Fighting games get, or more accurately, fighting games get progressively more fun the better a hold you have on them. Which is why a lot of people don't play more than one or two fighting games. Although there are those people who sort of play everything. I am one such person. That being Jumping jab. Oh my god, that combo. <laughs> I need to not do that ever again. A lot of people say Halo went to shit, but then no one agrees on when Halo went to shit. Most people seem to agree that Halo 2 was better than Halo 1, but then I hear a lot of people say Halo 3 was the last good game, Halo 2 was the last good game, or Halo 4 was the last good game, and I just don't know what to think. The real secret is that Halo was never a good game. <laughs> Halo, I played Halo 1, it was definitely good. I heard ODST was really good too. I just don't know what to think. It's like how Silent Hill. You know that game? Everyone's like Silent Hill 2 was the last good game. Silent Hill 3 was the last good game. Silent Hill 4 was the last good game. Silent Hill Origins was the last good game. The game I played last was the last good game. Yeah. 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 Or like Final Fantasy people do that too. They don't say it's the last good game. But they're always like fucking this isn't as good as last Final Fantasy. Whoops. Christ. Twelve is actually my favorite Final Fantasy. Followed by probably Tactics, then Seven. Tactics is well, amazing. Tactics is amazing. I don't know what Ryu does after ADX Sumo Headbutt. Maybe hard tattoo or reversal. I don't know. I don't know if that pack catch it. Anti air fierce, far fierce from Honda needs to be activated very early. It'd be much better off using uh, light headbutt or ex headbutt. Both very good reversal options. Nope. Mm, I appreciate the Dang. attempt. Whoa, that recovery is fuck. Yeah, yeah. The super is two headbutts. The ultra is one headbutt. Okay. Yeah. Damn. The ultra gives you very little time to punish. You should be looking for, um, you should sit on life leads deals and, um, well that's good. Oh, okay. too far. Sit on life leads and, uh, keep your back charge. And that way you can stop jump ins with lighter EX headbutt. Like that, yeah. Really important part of Honda is being able to, and you should, when, if they're fireballing excessively, you should use that neutral jump stop sign to steer around the fireballs. Neutral jump fierce. 
Can I grab the uh, the Shoryuken? No. Or is that not possible? It's unthrowable. Yeah. For like its whole animation. You can air throw the end. It's it goes from unthrowable to airborne immediately. Whoa. That was unsafe, I think. Wow, oh, watch these EX full screen headbutts. If that was a uh, anti air EX headbutt, you would already have won. Ooh, that was nice. Good pickup. Good pickup. Good salvage. You could have maybe chipped them out with a super volcano. I don't know how you would have gone about it safely, though. You had to get them to block something. That was a pretty nice looking jump from that back there. Like, borderline safe jump. It's quite e easy to safe jump Honda. Or, like, fake safe jump Honda. Wow! Interesting anti air. That was not a punish nor a combo. Don't focus Honda if you can help it. Okay. There are some things that do lose to focus that Honda uses. Yeah, protect those toes. I think oh. medium headbutt is invincible to lows, and definitely EX headbutt is. But those aren't always available. That's good, yeah. That's, sm that's smart, that's smart. That's what I was talking about. Yeah, that's what I was talking about at the end of the last round. Get him to, get him to block something, chip him out with super. It's a really strong strat. Afro, I'll consider doing something else than just throws. Let me go up. All right. Let's do some Ryu, Ryuing. Shit. I can play Ryu well, but I usually play him badly on purpose just to play him offensively. Or I shouldn't say badly, but unoptimally. Ryu is best, uh. at, best at zoning. I could have totally anti that. Ooh, nice. That was a bad forward dash for me. Ooh, damn. That hurt. Uh, a bad fireball. Yo, Vulcan is on fire. Yeah. Fuck, what? What thing is it? Thank you. Whoa, nice back dash. Oh. Uh, you're cornered, but I don't know if it's close you enough. Can trade that? You can trade if one of the players uh, is cornered. It doesn't yeah. matter. It doesn't matter which one. You know, fuck. Oh, that's the combo. Yeah. Alright. Yeah. That's nice. Uh. What? You mistimed it. Ah, uh, I mistimed it too. Level 2 focus is unsafe to level 2 focus. Wow. Ah, uh, I, I got it by negative edge. It's too late. It's too late. You should quick stood. Oh. Why don't you quick stand? Oh shit. <laughs> oh shit. I thought I FAD feed that. Shit. When I dropped that ultra, if you quick stood, you would have been able to get like jump around us and ultra on me. Or like, you know, uh, okay. jump around us, stand for your straw, you can FADC ultra. Some big combo. Whatever for whatever meter you had. Alright. Hey, I song. And that would have been really good. That would have done all my health. It was a big opportunity. When you get hit by a super or an ultra, you can't quick stand or a throw or a sweep. But um, um, because the ultra didn't actually hit you, you could have just been mashing. You could you could have been mashing it anyway, just in case. But you could have just been mashing yeah. quick stand, and then you would have gotten the quick stand if it didn't hit you, or it wouldn't have mattered if it did hit you. So you know, my cut is wide. <laughs> That's rude. Oh, that is rude. She's wide, so I can do that. That combo doesn't work on most characters. That level three. Okay. Mm -hmm. Oh, that was so deep.
Very right back. Chat. Damn, look at all this jumping. Oh, I tried to break that. Mm, I took a lot of white just now. Shit, that did so much. I tried to break that there, but I missed the window. Always hard chop if you only or hard stomp if you only have one bar. I mean, if you don't have any bars. I did it again, but I did light, and light's not very invincible. If I did medium, I'd probably beat it. Get a medium FADC Ultra, maybe. That would've been good. It's a little laggy, but not extraordinarily so. Okay, now it's kind of extraordinarily so. Whoa! That's not what I wanted. I'm glad that didn't dizzy. I deserve that. That would have worked even if I got my overhead off at the right time. Pick the wrong speed fireball at the end. That's something you don't think about very often. When you throw a fireball. Like a lot of people instinctively throw a lot of light fireballs and footsies because they control screen the longest. But sometimes it's good to throw a lot of... Um, sometimes it's good to throw a medium or a heavy one in a given scenario. So the fireball reaches them before they jump or something like that. It's difficult to uh, respond in either moment. The most important thing is varying your fireball speeds. Alright, I'm back with last game. Well, it's huh? Whoa, nice combo. Whoa, whoa, some of a nice combo. Where's the rest of it? How do you hold it? <gasps> but, uh, it's important to keep Relento in the corner, too. Whoa, 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 whoa. I should have done an actual punish. That move is not invincible as of, like, a long time ago. Mm, that was too early. I really like that you went for that. But I was too far out. And I dropped that combo. Look at that. Look how that hit. That was funny. If you'd crouched, that wouldn't have connected for sure. It's real good against that move. That's still a punish. Ryu still has a punish. Whoa. That's not a punish. Wait, no, it is. I just missed it. That's too far. I did that wrong. Should have cancelled it. That's not optimal. I'm not going for optimal at all. This is a sloppy round. You gotta hit confirm those records, that's really important. Rolanto's records are, um... bad. On block. Gotta make sure they're never actually blocked. No one in my chat said anything for a while. My chat might be frozen. Last message I have is what, what if Street Fighter had no chip damage? Oh, yeah, you're. I'm you're way behind. Little... All right, let me ref yeah. let me refresh it. I right, had everyone say the things they already said again. Jeez. 
Jesus. Please go, Pong. Whoa. <laughs> Life is hard. Dang. Damn. Bad Carol. To think the first time Kuro was in my stream, he almost got banneried. I don't actually remember anything about when Kuro showed up. I sung. I hear you've been doing work with Elena. A lot of a lot of people are coming to me like with advice on how to beat Elena because they're losing to you. I haven't level up my, leveling up my Elena. I hope you have. It's a lot of points. I probably would get more points than that with Lena. Damn. Not even dashed. Whoa, I like that. And I was greedy. That high block. Ew, I walked into it. I'm already doing badly. <laughs> That's not what I wanted. That move safe. If you block it, which you shouldn't. That was very greedy. Whoa, that was even greedier. Heal off. No, 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 no. Huh. You see Elena versus Elena very often if you're uh, in this stream. Because we've done that matchup quite a lot, actually. Hmm, not a good trade. fine. Whoa. Watch yourself. That can be a punish. I just missed it. Watch yourself. Don't fall off of the shell. I probably shouldn't sing in my stream, huh? Oh, fuck. Save that for karaoke night. <sighs> I should have karaoke night. I'm basically a song with combos. I don't know if Isong has combos yet. He might he might have appropriated them from last time. <laughs> Isong, have you appropriated combos yet? <laughs> Damn, Mickey's here to play some ping pong. Also I think I saw a donger in the chat. No. Uh. At first I thought the arms were the dongers, but now I think the whole thing is a donger. Okay. <laughs> shadows are fun as fuck to play and I will not stand anyone bashing people who play Shadows. Shadows are based. I've played Ken. I haven't played Ken like this whole night. Ken. 
Got rid of your white. Gotta be ready for overheads versus Lena. I would call that essential. Yep. Whoa. Haha. Uh -huh. That never works, dude. I'm just tired of going for it. Like Song says the only combo you can do is crouch medium, crouch light, crunch medium into spin scythe. Get more combos. Do Link's Tail combos. Link's Tail combos are really good. Look at that. How do I punish it? I'm not telling. <laughs> if you tell me how. Probably crouch medium kick. Alright. Into EX Fireball would be good. Mm, that's nice. Super, for sure. Ooh. I could have super that. Yeah. Oh. And that. Oh my god. Gah. And that. Perhaps. Whoa, lag. It's bad. Please. Like you're in it up dead. Maybe. I'm feeling it. Ouch. That's what I get. Yeah. For lagging. For lagging. Oh, I dropped it. I haven't dropped that in a while. Whoa. Fuck this. That dropped. <laughs> Link style has hit stun for two years. Two years in a day. Deals hasn't had like anything above a single red bar for like the entire time that he's been in here, but every time I played him, it's been full speed. I just don't know what to think about this matchmaking system. It's clearly perfect. So did you take Ger did you take English in school, or did you move there, or what? No, I I was born in Russia, and then I moved here when I was five. Damn. English. Yeah, I had it since like second or third grade. It was impeccable. Thank you. I wish I could speak another language fluently. I can only speak them badly. I can speak weird, though. <laughs> How about you get out of here? Ah. Uh. Gotta get this white back. Oh fuck. <laughs> yeah, you can use standing shortcut for Link's tail, just not crouching shortcut. Ah, oh, that's a punish. Fucking, I, I just got owned by someone who knows the character. Look at that nice meaty chop. Staying strong towards jab I think is Makoto's easiest link confirm, although I'm not certain of that. Saxor is now here. Oh, that connection just looks great. <laughs> Where is that? That's uh, New Zealand, I think. I always mix up New Zealand and Australia. Okay. They look damn similar. It's a Union Jack and a bunch of fucking shit. Stars. <laughs> Union Jack's link every fucking flag.
Watch your fireball. I did a Ryu combo. Ooh. That was greedy as fuck. That was also greedy as fuck. Oh, I stood into it. I've never had the opportunity to do that before, but it was very satisfying. I got the anti-air medium uppercut into EX uppercut. Medium uppercut has insane recovery, but you can juggle after it. Oh. I dropped that combo. I wouldn't say intentionally, but I went for something incredibly hard that I'm not sure works. <laughs> That's too the strong version. Shit. <laughs> My meter on combo. If you did an empty jump there, I would have whiffed. Oh, shit. That was a car throw. In a perfect world. Ouch. This will hurt. Bonk. Two hits. That's all I needed. You can't quick stand that either because it's an ultra. <laughs> did I just lose? No. If that was an FADC combo, I'd be dead. Oh, okay. It is Australia. What's New Zealand then? How do I always fuck this up? I need to just learn it. I need to look at flags. I probably know. I did a test where it was all 200 fucking whatever, 204, 200. How many, however many countries there are. Um, it, it had all the flags for every country and I had to, um, I had to look at them and know. And I got like 30. Which is pretty sad. It was, I think it was 40. I got like a, I got a pretty small percentage of the flags in the world. If I watched the Olympics, I'd probably have a lot more. I don't watch any international events though. In Europe, they always, they all watch fucking international events. That's what they do in Europe. So everyone knows everyone's flag. America doesn't give a fuck about any of that. It's just like America and Canada. A lot of Americans don't even know the fucking Mexican flag. Shit. That was a bad focus. It was especially bad because I did a focus. Why am I going for that link? That link doesn't work. I mean it does, but like it's not good. I think I saw a headbutt. That's good. That's a good headbutt. You're supposed to play this matchup as can, just by throwing lots of fireballs and being annoying and anti airing which is what I should be doing. <sighs> it's really important to be able to dodge fireballs without necessarily going for jump-ins, because jump-ins are very unsafe. Mm. So I don't know what else to do. Neutral jump them, and slowly creep in. You can steer his jump, his neutral jump fierce. You can go in or out while holding it, or just you know while doing it. So you do neutral jump fierce, and then you you go over a fireball with that, and use that to slowly approach. That's too far. I think so too. Yeah, I'm too late. Damn. <sighs> Struggle is real. Yeah, Honda's um not a common character to pick up. Uh, well, I played Ryu for like 150 hours, but I never really enjoyed playing him. So if you I like Honda, play Honda. Don't get me wrong. Honda's cool. Yeah, yeah. There's very few of them. I just like the fact that you have to do hands. Like, that's a, such a stupid motion, in my opinion. I thought... Never mind. You got, you got four other characters you can do hands, though, just for the record. You got Chun-Li's lightning legs, Gens, uh, Hyaku, Renko, or whatever, the fucking lightning hands. You got, ooh, yeah. um, DiCaprio's Rapid Daggers, you got Blanca's Electricity. It's just annoying motion. Yeah. 
Of those characters, I feel like DiCaprio's probably generously the best, although I do think um, the others are all passable. Possible exception Honda. But it doesn't really matter what tier your character is. The main thing is that you enjoy playing. Look at that. It's, yeah, way more fun than Ryu. <coughs> I like that you went for that Punish Life song, but you're way too slow. I'm glad that comboed. I was honestly expecting any X uppercut. Ah, hmm. oh, I could have released. Got that level two, and then I just backdashed. Ryu is boring. It says Split. Split, didn't you play Ryu for a while? That would explain it. That chipped before the last hit. I was like wondering if it would chip at all. Lane is 900 health really hurting her. That jab is good. Everyone always acts like it's a short, because it's a kick. Which confuses a lot of people. Why do I have ADC that? People act like they have to block it low, which is why they eat overheads all the time. Oh fuck. Got the bait. Hmm. Drops this link the other way. Whoa! It's like a reset! That was cool. Why am I running Ultra 2? It's like impossible to land in this matchup. I could attack that throw. Damn. Damn. I was pretty much shut down there. That's nice. Alright, time to play with both hands and both eyes. Since I was only playing with one before. No! What happened? No! That's a bad start. Alright, it's fine. I wasn't punished. Nice block. Shit, Lane is tiny. That was not an ultra. Probably intending to be. This could be an ultra. I was gonna say it's not gonna be a good one. Mm, that's a punish actually. Which is why that was cool. No, I missed it. I got the negative edge input after missing the why I song why. <laughs> Not like that, dude. Not like that. I know I dropped the combo, but like, f you should fuck. I should have lost. I didn't want to win like that. Just gotta, just gotta keep on crouching till the last hit. You can actually sweep and get under him, which is kind of cool. And then you can jump backward and like get a full jumping combo. It's kind of a neat thing. 